Welcome to another episode of Carbs. You're on Reckless Eating, the only show where we sit in the car. And BS, Wild Katsubi Carbs. We are back at Taco Bell to try their new Rockstar Punched Freeze. When I went to go get uh, their new tacos to do the, the double reviews, I'd forgotten they had this, and I had many, many people in the comments telling me about it. Let's go ahead and try it out, but first, subscribe to our gaming channel, Zion Mainframe Gaming, by clicking the annotation right there, it'll take you over to our Let's Play channel, combined with our personalities, it's sexual tension. I don't know why I put so much emphasis on the, the, that end part there, but it's very sexual. I'm, I'm thinking, like, we game naked. Here we go, let's try it, the Rockstar Punch Freeze. I love Rockstar Punch, or I loved, I don't, I don't really do, uh, I only really have the diet energy drinks now, and I, so I don't really drink that one, but there was... A summer of 69. That's what that is, by the way. It has to be, right? That song has to be about 69ing chicks during the summer of 69. He goes, oh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, there was one summer where uh, where I was drinking Rockstar Punch like crazy, gained tons of weight. But uh, they're really good. I, I do miss them. But, uh, hey, now we get to try it in freezed form at Taco Bell. Let's do it. I don't know if it's so much, I mean, I, there you go, okay, I got the Rockstar punched right at the end. At first it kind of just tastes like a generic punch freeze, but I do, I can taste it now, I can taste it, it took a second to kind of kick in. This was, uh, I believe $2.30-ish. So people were asking me to say prices, well, there you go, I tried. <laughs> Not bad. Yeah, that's weird. The first couple seconds, it doesn't register as anything other than generic punch, but then at the very end... I get that distinct kind of like minor carbonation of a rock star, and it is definitely not bad. I mean, this is this is delicious. All the freezes, generally speaking, are very delicious, and they're always super cheap. It's one of those classic impulse buys. Going through, getting some fast food Mexican food. There's so many people that are like, Taco Bell's not Mexican food. Then what the hell is it? It's Mexican food. It may not be your sit-down chimichanga, good quality Mexican food. Which, which basically is a contradiction in itself because any Mexican food is not the best quality Mexican food unless you find like a really fancy sit-down restaurant. And even then, it's usually just Mexican food and ingredients. But it's delicious. I love Mexican food. One more little sip here. Yeah, I would rival this with any 7-Eleven Slurpee or AMPM thing or whatever. I would rate this a solid five. Solid five, it's a good buy. It's cheap and it's gonna give you just diabetes like crazy. Terrible for your health, but anything at Taco Bell is going to be terrible for your health. And either way, that's that. It's good. It's very good. It does capture a rock star punch at the very tail end of it, but enough to where I would warrant it not just a generic punch and actually a rock star product. So good stuff. What are your thoughts on this bad boy? Let me know in the comments down below, and we'll see you on the next episode. <laughs> Reckless eating.